the tallest point in all of Rust. And here with me is Captive somewhere. All right, uh, yay. what's up? This is one of our fellow YouTubers that we do collaborative. Is that how you say collaborative? We'll just say co-op. Screw it. Yeah. Co-op gaming with. And we are here to show you a trick with C4. Now, for all of you that have been playing Rust for a while, you all know that it requires two C4 per door. But I'm here to show you that with a wooden base only, I've yet to figure out a trick for the metal base. You could completely bypass that and only use one C4. Now, in order to do this, you can place it anywhere here on this outside wall. So, for example, anywhere. place it here. And <laughs> you can now see that I completely bypassed the door and blew down the wall at the same time. And this is a much more efficient way of getting into bases. And I found this out accidentally while raiding a friend's base. And I was just like, wow, this is amazing. I could use half the amount of CP needed. And this is just a quick little tip I wanted to show you guys for those of you that didn't know it. Some of you may have already known of this trick. And I also I wanted to let you guys know we have our own Rust server. I'll be giving you the IP information and everything if you're interested in joining us. And it's only 50 slots. So... There's going to be limited space, but however, if the server gets full, we will be renting another server whenever that time happens where we need Yay. to rent another one. And with that, Captive and I like to bid you a good night because it's pretty late for us.